Well, hi guys. Here we have a Lenovo model number IdeaPad 320S. It's a 14 inch laptop. In some cases, it comes in the standard 15.6 inch as well. What's happened on this laptop is I'll turn it on and show you. It's very flimsy screen here. It's developed some hairline fractures in there, and you can see it needs a screen replacement. To replace the screen, all you need to do is take this bezel off and there's four screws and then there's a connector roughly about here and that's what we're going to do. And for this, all you need is a small Phillips screwdriver and a precision scalpel knife. Now to take off, I find a start here and all you need is strong nails. Get in there and just get your, that's it, and just slowly work your way all the way around to here now be careful when you get to the bottom there's some clips here where this bezel slots in this way and you don't want to pull it out you want to lift the top up and then you want to lift it away all right so hold that for a minute there get your nails under there there we are. Just work on the top. Oh, I've actually turned it on. This is the problem with internal sealed batteries. I will leave the screen on for now. Now you see here, now be careful here, just lift it up and away. So you're lifting it to the top that way. There. And that comes away. All right, put that to one side. So to take it off, you've got four screws. And they're very small and shallow. So let's begin. Four screws, all the same size, no problem. Put them to one side. Now you've got your camera cable here, so just be careful. Lift it from one side here. And you're connected there, so just lift it onto that way. Lift this up a little to give yourself a bit more because the cable's not very long. Now using your knife, just lift this sticker tape up. That's all you need to do. Slowly there, and be careful with this connector. You lift it up, there's something coming away there. And then using your knife, just on the gold plate on this one, just push gently away. There we are. So, it goes in that way. To take it off, you push away that way. All right, so. That's the old screen, discard, get rid of. We've got the new screen here, line it up, get your cable, just line it up and it should just slot in. I'm just, I like to be careful. There we are, it's all lined up and it goes in and pull on the tape and hold here and that's nicely in put the tape down lift this there we are and there's some location points here and reverse order but just before we do let's see if it works Yay, much better. So there we are, guys. Screen is good. She looks really pretty. Awesome. Great job. So I just got to put the screws back on and bezel. I don't want to put it all back on and then if there's a faulty with the screen, take it all apart again. Very fragile. Especially the screen on this one, probably one of the thinnest screens I've seen. 
Anyway, this is my friend's laptop. And he knows I do this sort of stuff. And he just asked me, Tops, can you please fix me laptop or have a look at it? And I thought, why not? Saves him from spending £400 on another one. And it's a uh, 7th generation, so it's not that old. And if you guys don't know, currently I think we're on 8th generation, to the best of my knowledge. So... It's just over two years out of warranty. And to give you guys an idea, I'm in the UK and this screen was £35 all in postage. So, not bad. I'm going to take this film off. Now, to put the bezel back on guys so just slot it in here and just make sure it clips onto those lower clips can you see it just catches on and then just work your way getting the clips to clip back in When you do the top, just make sure you hold it underneath. And just check, all good. Now we do the bottom. Support it with one hand at the back and just and done. There we are. Turn it on and check, all is good. Perfect. All right guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please leave a like and leave a comment and hopefully this helps you save and replace a screen for Lenovo IdeaPad 320S. Catch you on another video real soon. Thank you so much, bye for now.